New information out of Athens tonight on the suspect charged with killing 22-year-old Lakin Riley, that nursing student at Augusta University, killed of the University of Georgia's campus. Classes canceled in Athens today to mourn that young student, a junior on the dean's list. And tonight, police reveal the suspect lives in Athens but is not a U.S. citizen. Audrey Dick Herber, live force in the newsroom with the latest on all this. And Audrey, what are investigators saying about this suspect? Well, they tell us his name is Jose Antonio Ibera, and he is the only suspect in this case. And as you mentioned, he lives in Athens but is not a U.S. citizen. Police say the evidence against Ibera is robust, even before searching his apartment. Now family, friends, and students are left trying to understand what happened. I want to again express my most sincerest condolences to the family of Lakeland Riley and her community of friends both here at UGA and Augusta University. This is heartbreaking. This is a heartbreaking time for the university. Jose Antonio Ibera is being charged with multiple crimes, including malice and felony murder, aggravated battery, kidnapping, concealing the death of another and several other charges. He's being held in the Clark County Jail. The investigation suggests that they had no relationship uh, he did not know her at all. Um, I think this was a crime of opportunity uh, where he saw an individual um, and uh, bad things happen. Police say it was a crime of opportunity and the young nursing student was killed from blunt force trauma. Evidence suggests the suspect acted alone and police say surveillance cameras played a vital role in zeroing in on him. Our work, however, is not done. We are continuing to collect evidence and urge members of the community who may, uh, who may have pertinent information to call UGA Police Department. Tonight, police say there's no current threat to the community, but students and those who live nearby have been doing things differently since the crime happened. I've noticed that there's a lot more people traveling in packs now, and there's a lot less people wearing AirPods in. So I have noticed that. Um, just like earlier, I was in the Starbucks, and usually you go in there, you see a group of guys or a group of girls, maybe one or two, and now it's like four of, like just four of them in there. This case has been a combined effort with the GBI, UGA Police Department, athens Clark County Police, and other local agencies joining in. They're asking anyone with any information to call them. We'll have that number on our website at WRDW.com. It certainly was a team effort and a fast arrest today. Audrey, you also mentioned Ibera is not a U.S. citizen. Do we know where he's from? Well, reporter asked that question at the news conference, and the answer wasn't really certain, but the UGA police chief said the suspect is possibly from Venezuela. Audrey Dick Herber in our newsroom tonight. Audrey, thanks for the update there.